Patty cake, patty cake, big. Why'd you stop? I just got words above my head. Oh, you must have got your soulmate's last words. You mean their last words before they <coughs> die? Exactly. So, what's your soulmate's last words? I'm not telling. It's a secret. Sup, babe. We still on for tonight? Of course. Great. Catch you later. I think Derek might be my soulmate. He could be. Hey, what are your soulmate's last words? You never told me. I'm not telling you. That's between me and my soulmate. It makes me kind of worried, though. My soulmate's last words sound so sad. Finally, school's over. And we get to come back tomorrow and do it all over again. Banna, watch out! Stephanie, why would you do that? I'm calling an ambulance. There's no time. But don't worry. I'll live in your memories. La 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 la. Oopsies. No! You can't ever cut your hair. It holds memories. Who am I? Do you remember me? Do you still have all your memories? I think so. Everyone, I'm back with the milk. Who's that guy? Hey, girl. Hey, have you seen my boyfriend anywhere? No, I haven't seen him. Don't worry. Maybe he's running late. Yeah, maybe. Jake? Bestie? Brianna! Uh, I, I can explain. Don't bother. I want to forget I ever even met you two. I want to forget all our memories together. <laughs> Wait, what was I trying to forget? How was school? Great! I'm in love. Uh-oh, with who? With three boys. Jason, Kevin, Timmy... No, you can't fall in love with people that easily. Every time you fall in love with someone new, you lose 10 years off your lifespan. Brianna, look at this picture of Jacob Elordi's abs. Wow. Oh no, now I'm only going to lift till I'm 60. I can't ever fall in love again, so don't show me any more pictures of men with six packs. Are you really never going to fall in love again? No, I'm not. I need to live a long life. What's left of it? So I'm going to be celibate. Class, we have a new student. Jake, he came all the way from England. Hello, everybody. Oh, no. You fell in love again? You know there's a way to reverse it, right? Really? How? Fall out of love with him one day. <laughs> Mommy, I promise one day I'm going to be a princess for real. No, you should never make a promise. Now you only have 10 years to fulfill your promise, or else. Or else what? I go on timeout? A permanent timeout. When I was 10 years old, I made a promise that I would have kids one day. Now I have to have kids by 20. Whoa, that's so young. I know, I didn't know about the 10-year rule. When I was 6, I made a promise that I would be a princess. Brianna, that's never going to happen. There's no way a prince would marry an average citizen. I know. I'm probably going to be dead in the next year. Attention, everyone. What is going on? The prince is throwing a royal ball to find his princess. Even all you common folk are given a chance to impress the prince. Bye, Mom. I'm off to school. Don't go to school. Don't go. Actually, I'm not going to school today. I feel sick. Hello? Brianna, are you okay? Are you somewhere safe? Yeah, I'm fine. I just didn't go to school today. Well, it's a good thing you didn't. There were masked intruders at our school. Some people didn't make it out safely. And the worst part is, the police haven't caught them yet. One second. Chad's calling. Hey, baby. I miss seeing you today. Yeah, I missed you too, baby. Am I still coming over? No, don't let Chad come over. Chad, it's actually best if you don't come today. But I want to see you. I miss... Hello? Help, help. Let me in. Someone's chasing me. Please, don't let her in. Bye, Mom. I'm off to school. Wait, don't forget to put your blindfold on. The monsters can only see you if you can see them. Of course. How could I forget? Honey? Yes, Mother? It's your little sister's first day of kindergarten. She's never been out before. Look after her, okay? Of course. I promise. Sissy, make sure you're holding my hand and don't let go. I can't see. I'm taking this off. No, don't. It's okay. I know the way blindfolded. I'll guide you. No, I want it off. 
Sissy? Sissy? Do you have your blindfold on? <coughs> Sissy? I can't hear you. Hello? Everyone put on your headphones too. Brianna, you're late. Where were you? My sister's gone. There you are. Sissy? That's not her. How many words did you get this year? Zero? That's even less than last year. It's okay, baby. Don't be upset. How about I take you shopping? It will cheer you up. You like that dress? Alright, let's go buy it then. Oh, you want to try it on first? Alright, let's go. I'm very sorry, sir, but it's only one person per change room. No, I have to come with her. She's going to need help with the zipper. Don't worry, sir. I'll be there to help her with that. Please wait here. Oh, it looks like you got the zipper just fine on your own. Help me. Help you? I... Do you know that man? You're the princess. Oh, we must get rid of those commoner clothes immediately. Follow me. Wow, this gown is gorgeous. Princess, your years, they're at infinite. But how is that possible? When the princess meets her soulmate, she gets infinite years. You must be my soulmate then. No, that's not possible. You have infinite years and he doesn't. The princess's soulmate should also have infinite years after meeting. Stop. It's somebody else. Who else did I meet? Princess, it must be some kind of mistake. I know you're my soulmate. Will you marry me? Of course I'll marry you. You did save me after all. Prince? Prince, where are you? I need your help picking an outfit. I'm really nervous about meeting my real mother and father. Wait, what if the princess sees us? <laughs> Don't worry about her. She's clueless. I have her wrapped around my finger. Princess, are you okay? Who are you? After all this time, you still don't know me? No. Wait. Everyone, reveal your years. We must find the princess. The princess's soulmate should also have infinite years after meeting. It's somebody else. I do remember you. I have to show you something. Infinite years. So you're my soulmate, and not a prince? A servant boy? I'm sorry to disappoint you. I can't marry you. I must marry a prince and become queen. Are you ready to be married, princess? Don't speak to me. This is a transaction, not love. You will now be pronounced king and queen once your new crowns are worn. Wait, I object. Five times 84, Brianna, what's the answer? You can't use any words? Act it out then, please. 420 is correct. 420 times 69, Jimmy? Um, he didn't have any words left. Um's not a word. It's not a word. <laughs> Did you hear her scream in math class today? She's such a loser. <laughs> um, Brittany, you only had one word left. Please spare me. I didn't know how it was a word. Please. Yay, sissy came to pick me up. You two speak right now or I'm going to kill your mother. Mommy! I said speak! Anna, I don't want to be the one to tell you this, but that is not your mom. I am your real mother. She doesn't know what she's talking about. She doesn't even know me. You're right. You think you know my own mother better than I do? You're just never happy for me. Brianna, wait! Ella's mom, what are you doing here? Ella never came home from school yesterday. Since you're her best friend, I thought you might know where she went. I don't. I'm sorry. Jake, we have to cancel our date tonight. My best friend's missing. I'm really worried about her. That's no problem. Get some rest. You've been talking to Jake a lot recently. Yeah, I really like him. Honey, hurry downstairs. I have a surprise for you. Surprise! Ella, Jake... I don't think they're breathing. Since you like them so much, I brought them to you. GTG, I got a yeet to HS. TTYL, hit the books. What's up, bro? Homework was mad tough. Homework? I didn't finish it. <gasps> bro, you're gonna croak. You gotta spit slang. I, uh, I didn't, I didn't hit the books. Bro, I Probably not. Bro, bro. My best bro died. 
spit slang. I don't want to anymore. YOLO! Yo, Brie, you fine AF. <laughs> you wanna kick it? W Riz! Maybe. You gotta spit slang! Let's play a game. Selected. Why would you do that? One of us is going to die now! Yes, but one of us is going to get money. What game are we playing? A game of odds. Heads or tails? Tails! Alright, I choose heads then. No. It's tails. Uh, a redo? Just the granola bar? Yes, how much? Let's play a game. Selected. What game? Go fish. The ten of hearts? Go fish. <sighs> Joker. What? How did you know? You're a cheater! Um, I'm home. Sissy, let's play a game. Selected. No, you can't say those words. Everyone can hear your thoughts or you can hear everyone's thoughts. I can hear everyone's thoughts. People cannot know what I'm thinking. Hey, baby. Her mom is so much hotter than her. You think my mom is hotter than me? What? No, why would you say that? Her mother is the love of my life. I'd marry her mother if I was given the chance. Jason, we are over. Here's your test back, Brianna. You failed again. What? I failed again? I'm failing her on purpose. You've been failing me on purpose. Brianna, no throwing paper. Go to detention. I heard you broke up with your boyfriend. That's so sad. It's not sad. Yeah, it is. Let's go out on a date tonight. It will cheer you up. This is how I learn all my victims. She's next. You're infected with whispers. What does that mean? You'll keep hearing whispers in your head. Then they'll take over. Then you'll start whispering. Then you'll die. No, no, I can't die. There has to be a cure. There's no cure. Only one person has ever survived from it. We have to find the person who survived. Brianna, stop, Brianna, stop! Brianna. Whispers are all I can hear. Did you find the name of the person who survived? I'm looking. What are you doing? You're infected with whispers. I have to kill you before you start whispering and you start killing everyone. No, please don't. I promise. I can find a cure. No. There is no cure. Well, I have to try. You can't hide from me. You can't hide. Brianna, are you okay? You need to stop whispering. You have to try and fight it. I'm trying. You need to fight it. I can't. I can only live if there's light, but I die if a light shines on me. A shadow! A shadow! Correct answer, a shadow. <sighs> Bye, Mom! I'm off to school! Sissy, I got a riddle! Hurry! Read it to me! What can run but can't walk? A turkey? No! Don't say turkey! Final answer. It's a river! It's a river! Are you sure? I think so. A river. Correct answer, a river. Oh no. I just got a riddle. Hurry! Read it out loud! We can all help you! What has 21 eyes but can't see? 21 eyes but can't see. Come on! Give him suggestions! I don't know! I know the answer. It's ten and a half blind people. Incorrect. Correct answer. A dice. Oh no. I got another riddle. What is more useful when it is broken? It's an egg. It has to be an egg. No way, it's a glow stick. Say glow stick. So which is it? An egg. A glow stick. If I don't get this right, I'm going to die. The final decision is yours to make. An egg. Correct answer, an egg. Mom, I'm home. No, I got a riddle. You need to read it out loud. What is always in front of you but can't be seen? Right in front of you, but you can't see it. Air! It has to be air. It's always right in front of you, but nobody can see it. The answer, air. Incorrect. Correct answer, the future. Mommy's gone! I... I really thought I was right. <laughs> I got a riddle again. What can fly but has no wings? I... I don't know. I don't want to be wrong again. Please help. Simon says everyone touch their nose. Hurry! Everyone touch their nose. Everyone touch their head. Hurry up! Everyone touch their head!
No. They didn't say Simon Says. Simon Says, rip your test paper in half. Brianna, why did you rip your test? You won't be given another one. That's okay. I got a Simon Says. Simon Says, everyone stand still. Everyone start walking. Don't move, they didn't say Simon Says. Simon Says, start moving. These Simon Says are getting worse and worse. I got a Simon Says to break up with my boyfriend. That's awful. Simon Says, kill your best friend. Simon Says, kill your best friend. What are you doing? God of Simon Says, I have no choice. I have to kill you. I got the same one. Look, we can find a way out of this. How can we get out of this? There is no way out. Simon says, don't blink. Oh no, I'm gonna blink. Simon says, once someone blinks, everyone will be able to blink again. Hey! No, please don't. She snapped fingers in my face. She cheated! I can't. I can't do this anymore. What's wrong? I don't even know who I am anymore. First, I kill my best friend. Then, I make someone lose and Simon says and- You're not a bad person. You can't blame yourself for what the game makes you do. You're nice. What's your name? It's Simon. Your name is Simon? Are you the one running Simon Says? I'm one of many. There's one of us in every school, every workplace. But you can't tell anyone about this. Why are you telling me all this? Because I think you're cute. And I'd like to be in a relationship with you. Okay. Let's be in a relationship then. Great. Mom, I'm home. I had a really rough day. What are you doing? Put the gun away from your head. Simon says, let her do it. I got a Simon says to kill you, but I can't do it. I have to off myself instead. Mom! Simon, did you tell my mom to kill me? Simon says, don't reveal his identity. I only did it because I knew she wouldn't hurt you and would end up offing herself instead. What are you doing? Simon says, go to hell. Humans, you may now exit your incubators. <sighs> Good news, human number 69,000. Hazard levels are low today. You'll be able to attend school outside. No way. Do you have all your protective equipment on? Yes, I'm all ready. Here, take this oxygen can with you in case oxygen levels drop while you're outside. Thank you. Wow, outside. Mm. Wow, it's so great to see other humans. I know, isn't it? Danger, don't stand too close to each other. I think I'm alone. Hey. We're not supposed to be so close to each other. And you're not supposed to take your face shield off. You're right. Can I hold your hand? No, without gloves. Danger. Only be able to tell the truth or only be able to lie? Hmm, only be able to tell the truth. I don't want to only lie. Huh? I love you, beautiful. I hate you, ugly. What? You hate me? Do you not love me anymore? No, I don't. So what? Do you want to break up then? Yes. Fine then. We're over. Forever. Yes, go away. Did you do the homework? No. Well, what are you giving me then? Is this the homework? No, it's not. You said you didn't finish the homework. What are you giving me then? No, I didn't finish the homework. I don't want you to take it. Keep it then. Ugh. All the money we raised for charity was taken out of the safe. Does anyone know what could have happened? Brianna? I know. Who did it then? Was it you? Yes. <gasps> Sissy. You know. Ellie? Sissy. Ellie. Did they lock you in the cabinet? Hurry, I'm losing oxygen. No, this better be the one. Ellie. I'm so glad you found me. It was so scary. They took me and hid me in the cabinet. This game is sick. Brianna, why do you look so down today? My little sister was chosen to be hidden this morning. I almost didn't find her in time. How about we make a pact? Pinky prompts that if either of us gets hidden, we'll find each other. Pinky prompts. It's your turn to be hidden. Marco! Polo! Marco! Polo! Polo! Marco! Safe! 
Emily. I'm so glad I found you, sissy. I was so scared. It was so dark. Marco. Polo. <laughs> you actually fell for it. Bestie, don't scare me like that. Chill, I was just joking. It's serious. My little sister Emily was chosen to play the game this morning. She almost didn't find me in time. <laughs> What's wrong with Cynthia? Her boyfriend died during the game of Marco Polo. He wasn't able to find her in time. That's awful. Everything's dark. Oh no. Marco? Mommy, what's on my face? It won't come off. That mark will never go away. You get a mark every time your soulmate gets hurt. You mean when he gets an owie? Yes, but not a physical one. An emotional one. Great, you're here. I'm glad I found you. We need to break up. What? Why? We can't be together. You're not my soulmate. You have all those marks on your face. I haven't been hurt that many times. Fine. Whatever. Hey, you haven't said anything all class. Are you okay? My boyfriend broke up with me because I have so many marks. He said he's never been hurt that many times. But I really thought he was my soulmate. <laughs> Not only are you short, but you're also dumb. <laughs> hey, leave that dumb short kid alone! Are you okay? Yeah, I think you're my soulmate. Huh? Come on, we've been paused long enough. Can you press play now? How are you not paused, but everybody else is? I don't know why, but I have the same ability as you. I can pause time. We must be the chosen ones. I'm sorry, but this is real life, not Star Wars. Wait a minute. So if you press pause, it stops time not only for you, but for me too? This restaurant you brought me is amazing. You know I know how to treat a lady. Let's kiss. Why aren't you breathing? James! Okay, I can't wait any longer. I'm leaving. Hey, can I ask you something? Sure, what? Well, I just think you're super fine and- Brianna, hurry up and unpause it before I lose my riz! Um, I'm not paused. What? I'm starving. Here, take our last two dollars to the market and get us some food. I don't have the strength to walk to the market, and besides, two dollars isn't enough to buy us a meal. Well, you need to try. Now go. I have two dollars. Can I? Get lost, beggar. Hi, I... No. Mother's going to be so upset with me. I'll give you two magic beans for two of those coins. Two little beans? But they're so small, that's not enough to feed us. They're magic beans. Deal. I'm starving. What did you bring? I brought magic beans. Let me see. <gasps> those beans aren't big enough to feed an ant. What just happened? Ah! Why do you look like that? Miss, you dropped this. Oh, no. I don't have a hat. Really? Well, you should keep it. It suits you. Okay. She's kind of right. It does kind of suit me. Hey, girl, that hat looks so cute on you. No way. Bestie, you hooked up with my brother? Uh-oh. How did you find out? Whoa. I guess this hat tells me people's secrets. Hey, Derek. So, <laughs> You're afraid of the dark? What? No, I'm not. Then come here. Let me cover your eyes. No, don't. I'm scared of the dark. <laughs> Hi, Bree. Have you seen Katie anywhere? No, I haven't. Why? She's been missing for two days now. Everyone's been searching for her, but no one knows where she is. Did everyone get their compass? What? No, I didn't get my compass. Here you go. Why do I have a compass? It's to help you find your soulmate. Whichever direction it's pointing in is the direction your soulmate's in. If it starts dinging, they're close. If it dings rapidly, you found them. What if your soulmate's in a different country? Then I suppose you'll have to walk very far. <laughs> this is never gonna work. It says my soulmate's west. Let's go. Where's your compass? Are you not trying to track your soulmate? What's the point? I highly doubt my soulmate is anywhere close. <gasps> it was your compass! Where is he? It's pointing east. Let's go. It's pointing north. It just took me in a circle. What in the world? I quit. This thing is broken or something. That was two dings. That means you're getting closer. Hey, girly. Why are you so happy today? 
You wouldn't believe it. I met the sweetest guy and he's rich. Are you sure he is who he says he is? What do you mean? Have you heard of public data check? No. What is this? You search the person by name or phone number and it will show you a background report. It will show things like past addresses, social media, financial disputes, and if they have a criminal record. You would not believe what I just found out. What did you find out? He told me he lives in a mansion. He lives in an apartment. Guess he's not rich then. And uh-oh. What? Oh, mama, I'm in love with a criminal. What do you do? You wouldn't believe it. Okay, honey, reveal your letter. Wait, I want to get it on video. Are you recording? I am. Reveal it, sweetie. An F? F must mean for failure. Steven, be nice. Keep this on at all times. No one can know your letter. Mommy, I don't want to wear this. I look silly. You have to wear it, okay? Why do you always wear that headband? You look ridiculous. I just like it. Take it off. I need to see where you stand in the hierarchy. Don't. I said, take it off. Move your hand. That must stand for failure. You must be the lowest ranking in the hierarchy. <laughs> How embarrassing. You got an F. Wait, did I just hear you got an F? Fs are actually very special. Brianna, can you come with me for a minute? There's something really important you should know. Well, I'm going to be the fairy. You can be the princess. Can I play with you guys too? No, don't let her play with us. She's weird. <laughs> you really think we'd play with a weirdo like you? All right, class, finish handing out your treats. Look at her. She's already chubby and so ugly and she's still eating. <laughs> Are you not having breakfast? No, Mom. I'm not hungry. Are you wearing a sweater and track pants to school again? It's so hot out today. I know, but I'm really cold. <laughs> Look at that huge pimple on her chin. Shh. She's looking this way. Hey, can I sit with you? Why are you covering your chin? I have a pimple. I don't see anything. You don't? No. Where's your lunch? I don't eat lunch. Here, have half of my sandwich. You look like you're about to pass out. My soulmate's accent is American? That's so boring. But I might. Your soulmate's accent is Australian? And yours is... British. It's British. You didn't sound like you were speaking in a British accent earlier. Well, I was. Um, pip pip cheerio. Class, we have a new exchange student. He's from Britain. Hello. Brianna, didn't you say your soulmate's from Britain? Aw, oh, that must be your soulmate. I heard your soulmate's accent's from Britain. Mm-hmm. That's great, because mine's from Canada. You must be my soulmate, then. Yeah, maybe. Chad, you're late. Class, we have another exchange student from America. Yo, what's up, my dudes? Attention everyone, today is the day to choose your maximum time left. Remember, 80 years is the ideal, 100 is the maximum. I wish Brianna would choose less time. <laughs> Mom, I'm home. I could really use someone to talk to. I had a really bad day. I'm sorry, honey, but I have to work late again tonight. I left money for pizza on the counter. You know what? I'm picking the red one. Well, I guess picking the red one doesn't do anything. It says I have zero time left and I'm still here. Ellie, have you seen your sister? I haven't seen her all morning. I don't know. Maybe she already left for school. Mom, what are you talking about? I'm right here. Maybe. I'll just go check her room. Ow, you literally just bumped into me. She's not in her room. Ellie, tell mom. Sissy, where are you? I'm invisible. Welcome to the Harvard interview. Now, before we get started, we're going to have to ask you to remove your foundation. What? Why? We received a tip from someone that you have an unfulfilled promise. I'm sorry, but this is just protocol. Alright, so I was lying. I have an unfulfilled promise. But I meet every other requirement and then some. The interview's over. I'm going to have to ask you to leave. How'd the interview go? They found out. They said they received a tip from someone. But how is that possible? No one else but us knew. Hey mom, the interview's over. Can you come pick me up, please? Thank you so much for the heads up on Brianna. Yeah, of course. I wouldn't want someone getting into Harvard dishonestly. Your interview is tomorrow. You make a great candidate for Harvard. Thank you so much, sir. <laughs> Mommy, why are you crying? It's your baby sister. She's not going to make it. The doctor says she only has 100 heartbeats left. Here, she can have half of mine. I don't need that many. Honey, wait. 
Hey, girl. Hey, I、uh, gotta go. Hey, wait. You know I can tell when something's off about you. What's wrong? I only have enough heartbeats to last me one more day. Here, I'm giving you half. No, you really shouldn't have done that. Now you're gonna live half as long as you should. Come on. Now, how could I live this world without you? Mom, I'm home. Hurry, we have to go to the hospital right now. Mom's sick. Mom, what happened? It's my heartbeats. How much do you have left? Three thousand. So I'll give you half. Honey, please live a long life for me. No, I can't live without you. You have to. Goodbye.